What is up guys? It is me Max back again with another special video. Two videos that have been from the up close and personal playlist from my channel. So that's new and there is a reason for that because this is first of all finally the 10,000 subscribers special. It's been ages since we hit that like we're over 13,000 now first of all thank you for that that is amazing and second of all it's my birthday so yay me I guess something like that and I pushed this whole special back because I want to show you guys the new apartment and I wanted to do a full room tour and I couldn't do that or I didn't want to do that until the whole place was finished which it now is so here we are, and we're going to combine that with the Q&A that you guys sent me questions for in order to like answer them in this video, I guess. So we're going to combine each room with one question from you guys. So let's start. So we're starting things off on the balcony, which is like the heart and soul of this whole apartment because we both, me and my roommate, who's behind the camera right now and doesn't want to show himself yet. I'm going to get him to do that at some point. Um, we both love sitting out here like in the evenings, enjoying what nature has to offer here. Like, of course, there's other buildings, but like we still are pretty much in the green here, which is great. And the first question from you guys was, how old were you when you started playing guitar? I was actually nine years old and my parents said, back to the question, my parents said, you gotta learn an instrument, which one do you want to play? So they kind of gave me the choice and I chose guitar, which was like the best decision I made in my entire life up until this point, I guess. And yeah, I've been pretty happy with that. I'm glad they gave me that choice and didn't force me to play like, I don't know, piano or something like that. A lot of people are forced to play by their parents. So yeah, that's question number one. So now we're back in the living room. We've got our couch here, which is extremely comfortable, even though it was rather cheap because most of the furniture items here were rather cheap because the whole moving process costs so much money that we have to cut expenses at some point. We've got our TV here. We've got like the whole party decoration going on because that is actually starting in like 20 minutes and I'm in kind of a time crunch here because I already recorded this entire video and then I realized I forgot to turn on the microphone, so we didn't have any audio. Here I am again, saying the exact same thing I said last time, but hey, here we've got the dinner table with like everything that my mother and my grandmother prepared for this party, which is pretty amazing. I'm looking forward to downing that in a couple of minutes. We've got some shelves, we've got some stuff. And it's time for question number two, which is, who was your inspiration? And I gotta say that was probably for the most time Ian Ja from Billy Talent because I love the way he combines chords with lead melodies. It's freaking amazing. And obviously people like John Frusciante from the Chili Peppers as well, because like those two are my favorite bands. Billy Talent, like from way back and they've been sticking around like in my heart, if you can say that, ever since. And the Chili Peppers kind of took over, I would say, because my taste in music obviously developed over time. So yeah, those are the two. So now we're in my roommate's room. Fun fact about my roommate, he isn't just the cameraman right now, but he's also my best friend and has been on the 1000 subscribers special. He's been involved in that and taking pictures and filming and all of that. So he's been around for a while on this channel and hopefully he will still be, and I, I guess he will, unless he like ditches me for whatever reason. Maybe I'm too hyped. I don't hope so. Table, couch, window, playstations. That's it. Question. All right, what do we got? We got, do you have a song that you like to play the most? I guess that would probably be either Turn Again from the Chili Peppers or Sweet Child of Mine from Guns N' Roses because both of those have gorgeous, mind-blowingly awesome guitar solos in them. So I would say one of the two. I couldn't really 
choose, but I would probably choose Sweet Child of Mine since it's just such a classic, I guess. I'm kind of a sucker for classics, but next room. Next up, we're in the bathroom, which is rather tiny, so there is not too much to show. Bathtub, sink, toilet. And the next question is actually, do you have any other hobbies apart from shredding? And that's why I'm not showing the entire room yet, because there is one little feature that answers that question, because I hope you can at least kind of tell a teeny tiny bit that it's fitness, that is like my other big hobby, which is why we've got Markus Rühl, the German tank on the wall here, because, well, I mean, he's a funny guy, <laughs> none of us want to look like that, but it's like a gimmicky kind of thing, and it's something weird and kind of interesting to look at in the morning, like when you're brushing your teeth and you see that every day. I guess that's something, I'm not sure what it is, but it's something. Next up, we've got the kitchen. We've got a big ass fridge over here that is always filled to the brim with stuff, even though it's that big because you always have way too much stuff to put in it. And we've got a huge pile of food over here in that shelf. <laughs> we've got our stove and sink and everything over here. The thing my cameraman almost tripped over is beer with ice for tonight's party. And we've got like a couple of appliances over there. And next question is going to be, no question, but you are adorable. <laughs> <laughs> Jesus. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> that almost cost me my phone, which is already pretty freaking broken, so that would have probably killed it. But, uh, where are you from? I thought you sounded Aussie, but then you said English was not your first language. Your English is amazing, by the way, even though I'm stuttering like, like I don't know what I'm... <laughs> you see what I mean? That guy... <laughs> It's not my first language, sometimes it is hard, but you sound just like us. Well, thank you for that, even though right now I kind of screwed that up. The first take was so much better, ah, but I am actually from Germany, so maybe sometimes there is an accent involved, but I've spent a lot of time in the US, like about two years, I think, something like that and I watch all of my movies and TV shows and read my books in English because, well, there's the saying, blank was lost in translation, so, like, the original is always going to be a bit better and, like, closer to what the original people behind the show wanted it to be like, so, yeah, I guess that's where that is coming from. Final room. The last room is actually my room. We're starting it off with this huge ass wardrobe, which is like a container. I freaking love it because it's so unique. We've got my uh, computer set up with like my whole gaming equipment because I am quite the gamer boy, if you want to put it in the mean terms. We've got my bed over here, which is freaking comfortable, especially because I've been sleeping on this mattress on the floor for about three months straight now, and that's been killing my back, so this is heaven right now. We've got the TV, we've got my clothes in there, or a lot of them, and like some university equipment, my keyboard, all of that stuff. And we've actually got one new addition to the guitar family, because you know most of my guitars are in the background of my videos back at my parents' house, but I wanted a new guitar for like, reasons, because I love collecting guitars, and the newest one is a D'Angelico Western guitar. The sound on this thing is amazing. You're going to be hearing a lot from that here, because I'm actually going to take my Ibanez classical guitar back home to my parents' house when I record there on the weekends, and I'm going to be leaving this thing here for the videos I'm recording here, so look forward to that. The sound on this thing is mind-blowingly awesome. And as you have been able to tell, or might have been able to tell, I've been pretty much recording daily videos at the moment, and I'm trying to keep that up. It's pretty time-consuming, and I can't promise that there's going to be a video every day, because either 
I don't find a proper song or the song I find is too hard and can't be like fully done in one day or I really don't have the time because of uni and stuff. But I'm really trying my best to make it a daily thing or as often as possible at the moment. And ever since I've been doing that, the channel has been growing even more and I couldn't thank you guys enough for that. The first guests are here. I'm gonna have to wrap this up. First of all, thank you for 10,000. Thank you for 13,000. Thank you for everything that's going to come. I love interacting with you guys. I love the comments. I love all the feedback you guys give me. And bottom line is, <laughs> fuck off. Ah, I love you guys. And as always, I hope that I will see you next time.